Hey guys, Ariel Guru here. I hope you're all doing well. Let's get straight to the tech news. Syntec Vertronics, uh, which is a company that makes displays, has sent Apple 20 inch touchscreen samples. Now, this could mean that you could expect a new touchscreen iMac coming up pretty soon. In my opinion, it's cool to have a touchscreen display, but you still need the mouse and the keyboard because they're much, much, much more comfortable to use than a touchscreen, especially in a desktop computer. The new $99 Apple TV that was released a couple of days ago has been jailbroken by MuscleLearn from the dev team, um, which means it will be able to run apps pretty soon, not quite yet. But if you want a jailbroken Apple TV, dev team recommends that you buy it as soon as you can, because Apple may patch it, and then it will be a while before a new jailbreak comes out. The last of the day is Chrome OS running on the iPad. Hexay, who is a 17-year-old hacker who makes... Chromium Builds has ported the Chrome OS to the iPad. It is not as smooth as iOS, but it is pretty good for something not native and something that's not built for the operating system. It's nice to see operating systems other than iOS running on the iPad. Thumbs up this video and comment with your thoughts on the stories I talked about today. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye bye And it runs pretty well, I've got to say. It's not as smooth as iOS, but it is. It is. It's nice to see new. Uh, it's nice to see. <laughs>